So the next update I will do is about Fred Hutch because everyone, that's the one everyone is most hopeful for, myself included. Fred Hutch um, Cancer Research Center is actively working on a cure for herpes and it's led by Dr. Keith Jerome and his team. And so I believe it was last week he put out a brief update. So the update came because um, they have a crowdsource fundraising um, page on the Fred Hutch website and they reached their goal of 1.25 million raised. So um, every time a goal is hit, typically Dr. Jerome or Fred Hutch will put out some, tor some kind of uh, update for the people who have donated. So this is the start of the update. As you can see at the very top, it says update on the HS HSV gene therapy program. Starts with um, just thanking everyone for their support. And this is what I would say is the most interesting. So this paragraph talks that they have established a company ca called Caladan Therapeutics. I don't know if that's how you say it. And that apparently creating a company is common and essential in developing medical treatments and diagnostics. So this is like the next stage of where they're at with their herpes cure, or, yeah, their cure research. And so it says, having a company structure helps us protect the intellectual property and continue to develop and support work with the federal regulators. And then at just the end of this, this paragraph is having creating this business and having the business relationship um, between Fred Hutch and Caladan Therapeutics, um, they're able to receive a small business grant from the NIH, the National Institute of Health. So that will, again, write money grants to fund the research. So that is great on top of all the money that donors have raised. And so it's always a small update with Fred Hutch. And I know people get disappointed that they want clinical trials ASAP for humans and it's not going to happen immediately, but what can help is the advocacy and awareness. So they always will accept donations, even though they've reached their goal. There's always going to be a new goal. So, but that's kind of just the little update about Fred Hutch.